Hi, this is Mason from NextGen Personal Finance. In this video, I will be going over how to find the answer keys and assessments on the NGPF website. In order to access the NGPF answer keys and assessments, you must be logged into your verified NGPF teacher account. Please make sure that you are logged in. First, we will find the answer keys for lessons. In the NGPF menu, hover over the curriculum tab and click on the course that contains the lesson that you are using. For this example, I will click on the semester course. If I scroll down and look on the left side, I will see all the units. If I click on one of the units, I will see the lessons for that unit. For this example, I will click on the career unit. Here I can find a button that takes me to the student activity packet and the lesson guide, which contains the answer key for that lesson. You can do this for any of the courses that are listed under the curriculum tab. The course assessments and assessment answer keys can also be found through the course pages. First, hover over the curriculum tab and click on one of the courses. For this example, I will click on the semester course page. If I click on the course materials button on the left side of the page, I will be able to access the diagnostic and final exams, as well as the summative project. If the course you are looking for doesn't have a course materials section, then you can look for a summative assessments link to access the exams and summative project. If the course has unit tests, click the unit you are focusing on and scroll down. There you will be able to find the link to the assessment, the Google form version of the assessment, and the answer key. You can do this for any of the courses that are listed under the curriculum tab. Now let's find the answer keys for specific individual activity. In this example, I'm looking for an activity showcased in the first lesson of the banking unit in the semester course. It is called Move Your Account Balance. Because I know which course and unit it is a part of, I can find this activity on the semester course page on the right hand side of the banking unit resources. Once I see it, I will then click on it and the answer key button will populate in the modal. Answer keys for case studies, data crunches, and math activities can also be found on the right hand side of their corresponding course page when the specific unit is selected. Another way of finding activity answer keys is to use the resource itself to identify what unit it belongs to. For this example, we will be looking at fine print pay stub. I can tell what unit page to look on based on the description in the upper right hand corner of the activity Google Doc. On the NGPF website, I will hover over the curriculum tab and click on the career unit. Individual activities and their answer keys are on the right hand side of the page. I will look for the fine print under activities. Since I don't see it, I will need to click view more to find the fine print activity. Once I see it, I will then click on it and the answer key button will populate in the modal. Answer keys for case studies, data crunches, and math activities can also be found on the right hand side of their corresponding unit page. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you still have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to us at info at ngpf.org. Thank you.